Now we're rolling. Hey, welcome to Viking Preparedness. Guess what I've been up to? I've been getting this to split and put in there. Even though here we are in the middle of January and I am in shirt sleeves, I think it's probably 60 something degrees out. Gotta love the Ozarks. Hey, um, for those of you who've been following us for a while or who are on Patreon with me, you know that we are neo pioneers uh, trying to carve out our little place in what we term wilderness. It's really not. Um, but we're trying to do the things, raise critters, and so on. And I'm going to take this wood, put it on this pile, and split it. But before I do, I thought I would take a break and let you know about some interesting opportunities. You know you want to know. All right. Um, yes, it is that time. I haven't done one for a while. There is a big sale going on uh, with Olight. And I want to show you some things. I have used them all. Uh, some I'm good at, some I'm not so good at yet. We're going to talk about that a little bit too. But first, the Warrior X. I think it's a three. I should probably get the box. The Warrior X3. Look at this bad boy. Do you know how to fight? We were just talking on Patreon the other day about training yourself, getting trained, how to take care of yourself. This little flashlight right here, it's actually not that little. It's, it's stout, right? Uh, it has this interesting little device on there. Get off of me. Leave me alone. Let him go. Kind of thing, right? It has the button right here. So you can access it in a tactical manner. It comes in a really cool camouflage color, if you're into that. Um, 2,500 lumens. Gang, I am not a, a, a scientist, but 2,500 lumens lights this place up like nobody's business. It's like, who's out there? What possum is in my chicken coop? Those kinds of things. Uh, this is an awesome light. I have one just like this on my Minuteman bag uh, on the outside because it comes with this nice little case. Molly compatible. It can also go on a belt. You can also hang it from something. I've shown you these before. Fits in just like that. Whoop. Get in there. Just like that. Easy at hand, boom, right? Okay, so this light is on sale now. If you want one, you should probably check them out. All the info is down below. It also does this thing, I haven't charged this one up yet. They come partially charged. They tell you with all their flashlights, they give it a full charge before you play with it. And this light lets you know it's low because it vibrates in your hand when you turn it on and it's low. Oh. All their lights come a little charged, but not fully charged. You've got to charge it yourself. And the way you do that, they have this magnetic, what did I do with the box? They have this magnetic little goo -ga. I'm not gonna open it right now. A magnetic thing clips here, plugs into your USB port, charges up your battery. I love that because we live off grid. I don't, I don't have the ability to just go get batteries and so. I, but I can plug them in all day long and they recharge. Some people say I don't want to have to recharge my battery. Then buy another battery. <laughs> I mean, just like you do with everything else, you can do it. Um, but here you go. This is the Warrior X3 with a. It's a superior tactical thrower with a glass breaker. Get out of the car. Ugh. Right? So there you go. There's that bad boy. This one you've seen before. But look at the new color, ladies or men, if you're into that. They come in a variety of colors. This is the Seeker 3 Pro. Oh, this one. You thought the last one was bright? 4,200 lumens. This is like an aircraft landing light in a little hand-sized package. I like, you know, of course, the same uh, webbing holder dealy bopper. Look at this, though. It doesn't flop around. You just push it, open it, out it comes. It has comfy grip. <laughs> they probably have a name for it. But it has these little grips here. And this guy... You rotate it and turn it on. Oh, it just went off. 
and it goes all of their lights cycle through various modes to dim to super bright if you have it on really dim mode moonlight mode it'll last for days you can be in your little survival shelter uh, and you'll have light if you need to signal the space shuttle uh, you turn it on bright it doesn't last as long but this is a cool little light it comes with accoutrement that you can put the little wristband on here the little clip all those things um, but this one is called the Seeker 3 Pro. And yes, it's on sale. Special sale just for you, GI. All right, so there's that one. Now, they got this little guy. I think you can probably get this in a package deal. This little bolt action pen. Uh, it's a self-defense pen. Uh, it's really small. <laughs> um, that's what's cool about it. You know, you can st it fits nicely in your shirt pocket, but it's made out of steel and it has a knurled grip for easy grab to get off of me, Bobby. <laughs> right? Um, but it's just cool. It's a little conversation piece. Pull out, take notes. You do show up at meetings with your notebook and your pen, right? Yes, sir. I'm ready to take down everything you say because it's very important. And actually what you're filling out is your grocery list for when you get off work. Uh, but here you go. This little pen. The Olight O-Pen Mini. I think it's cool. Now we're going to get into something that uh, I'm not a technical guy. If you hang out on my Patreon channel and you hear me talk every day, <laughs> you know I'm not into the technical stuff. This light is almost beyond me, but SK and I are really happy to start playing with it. This is called the O-Lamp, I think. Here it is. Oh, the night tour. The O-Lamp night tour. This is what it says, transform your, transform your home vibes. Colorful, convertible, rechargeable LED lamp. It has, let me just show you. And again, oh, look, I turned it on. Can you see it's blue? Can you see that? It has all these different colors that you can toggle through. And brightnesses, I think it said 360, something like that. I don't know if you can see that out here. It's very bright out here today. Should sing to you when you do it. Anyway, it can set the mood in your room, man. And then this light right here, um, this works. I haven't figured this out quite yet. When you're charging it, you push on this button. And it works like a night lamp and you know it it whoop. you broke it PJ no I didn't I'm gonna show you something cool about it it rotates like this and so we're looking forward to putting these next to our bed so that we can read with them but here's what I thought was really cool about it so it's you can, the lamp comes off look at that Ooh. comes off you can recharge it separately or it can go on there like that and if you shake this thing there's no button on it if you shake it it comes on so but there's a way you got to shake it. I've been playing with it. Nope. Nope. There we go. Like I said, I got to learn it. There's an instruction manual that's like you're trying to build a computer that comes with this thing, but it has a lot of different modes. And uh, now I don't know how to turn it off. I have to read the directions. There we go. I turned it off by shaking it. But I thought the cool thing was you're sitting there reading. <gasps> And then something goes bump in the night and you got to check it out so you can take it off and go explore, explore your world. Um, so I thought that was cool. Plus it's magnetic so you can stick it on metal, you know, or whatever. Um, so this is the O-Lamp uh, by Olight. It's also on sale right now. Where does that go? Right there. And then this guy. What you don't know, we have solar, clearly, uh, but... Sister Kate and I only turn on lights in our house while we're eating supper. And then other than that, we turn them off and we operate via headlamps. Rechargeable Olight headlamps. Uh, but they have a new one that I'm going to play with. And I don't even remember what this one's called. The Array 2S. The Array 2S. Hand wave control triple task headlamp. This is another one that comes with an instruction book. Um that i haven't quite figured out yet but i was showing it to sk and so you can you can manipulate everything with the with the button there's a little light Ooh. 
It was brighter, 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 cycling through. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, I can see it in the reflection. There we go. Um, and then I guess if you turn it on and you wave your hand, that see how it got brighter? And it goes down. And then if you go left or right, it does other things. Woo, look at that. Woo, woo. It's like some commando movie. Um, and it has, I guess, red in here, too, and other things. And since it's a little light with a battery pack on it, I'm thinking, once I figure out how to use this thing, uh, this might be a good helmet light, actually, because this much battery is going to give you a lot of time on this bad boy. And so here's the deal. You need a headlamp. You need a couple of them. You should have one in your car so that things break down and you got to work on it at night it's easier to be able to use both hands and just have the light on your head thusly we on now do we make it brighter see i gotta read the directions <laughs> but you can use both your hands i like it in hunting my little hunting pack has a headlamp in it and so when you're using both your hands to deal with the critter at night which it always happens you know it's like just as dark's coming as when you shoot your deer. Um, that's good. In your medical kit, your trauma kit, you should have headlamps so you can throw them on and get to work. Anything that requires you to use your hands, you should have a headlamp on. SK and I, like I said, every night we put a headlamp on uh, before we go about it. As it's getting dark, we go get them and, and we put them on and we just wear them. That's because we're off grid. You're not off grid. I know you just go, the light is on, the light is off, the light is on, the light is off. But you should have headlamps because you won't always have this glorious electricity that is flowing into your house right now. You're going to need light. And then finally, um, and again, all the links are down below to the sale and all that. You should go check it out. This one, I don't think this is on sale this time, but man, I love this light. Um, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you uh, the application of this light. This is called, what is it called? The Odin Turbo. Rethink limitations. Consider the unthinkable. Contemplate the unthinkable. This bad boy, I've shown you this before. There's the, the uh, let me just, so much stuff comes with these guys. This is what all their rechargers look like. It's a little magnet, clicks on there, it goes into a USB port. This is a weapons light, flat out. I mean, yes, you could carry it in your pocket and you could, you know, use it like, like that. Um, but it's a weapons light. You can get this switch cap that goes on the back. And then that makes it turn on and off. So, you know, the pressure pad switch, Oop, turn it off. Um, comes with mounts that you can mount on your weapon here's a mount this mount again it's all technical stuff man some of you guys are tech heads you'll love it this mount goes on here and then this clips on your stuff you know blah 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 what i like about this one let me show you something 330 lumens it's only 330 lumens that's super bright but here's the interesting thing 1,000 plus meter throw. We took this into a pasture and fired it up and it goes all the way across the pasture and lights a dude up. But here's the thing, it shoots a narrow beam way out there. Well, what would that be good for? Um, if you're down behind a hardened position or uh, it's survival time and deer are walking across your back bean field right there, <laughs> turn off the light and move, right? Uh, turn it on, fire it up, turn it off, move. There are applications for this light for those of you with uh, discriminating tastes. Like I said, I'm not sure this one's on sale, but I really like it. And anything that's not on sale at any time on uh, Olight, you can use the code Viking and get 10% off. So 10% is 10%. That's going to save you the tax uh, at a minimum. So this is called the Odin Turbo. And this thing basically puts a light that just goes, it's almost like a laser. Shoots really far. It would be good if you're signaling, if you're stranded in your boat, bobbing around in the ocean or something. And, you know, a ship goes by on the horizon. You could do SOS on it or, hey, we're over here. Or, you know, do your hourglass or whatever. 
but hey guys yeah there's a sale going on at Olight again uh, I know some of you are worse than I am about flashlights and you're just like collectors it's like oh that's a new one in uh, here you're about to learn something about me I don't know if this is blue or purple what color is it I don't know I'm colorblind I had to cheat three times to get in the special forces <laughs> Oh, see the battery went out. Oh no, you got to turn this one. That's the safety. There we go. Yeah, see, technical. You got it. What we used to say, you got to be smarter than the piece of equipment you're dealing with. Um, so, yep, yeah, there's a manual of arms. <laughs> there's a, a user's manual with each one of these, but these are cool. This one won't go off by accident. You have to spin this little thing and then turn it on, which is easy enough to do. See, um, but there you go. This is the Seeker 3 Pro. I showed you the other ones. Go to the link below, check them out. Uh, I'm interested in what you think. All right, I'll see you out there. Literally.